This video is going to support someone using Google Sheets and then how to reference the data uh, with some support, such as how to make a header out of row one by freezing that row and freezing the column A, as well as then to be able to have alternative alternating colors uh, so that it's easier to tell what line you're on. So let's get started. First off, to freeze the view of row one, so it appears like a header. So right now, if I scroll down to row 21, I can't see what the heading is for row one. So I want that to stick, one might think. So I'm going to view, freeze, up to current row one. Now, when I do that, you'll see this kind of gray bar show up underneath. And that's telling you that's where the view is frozen. So as I scroll down to row 21, directly below one shows that it looks like five, but really it's just frozen and lock that header of student. Next, I'm going to do the same thing for column A, because as I would scroll across, I can't tell whose assignment this is here for 46 in row eight. So I'm going to select all of column A Go to view, freeze, up to column A. So as I scroll across, I can still see that, oh, this 46, it's Luke's. All right. So next, I've got my header in row one. I've got my column A frozen with the freeze view. The next thing is I'm going to select all by either using a keyboard shortcut of control A or selecting up here in this top left corner, this item here. You can see now every row, every column is selected. I'm now going to go to Format and choose Alternating Colors, and a menu will come up on my right. That menu is going to go to the default that says, I'm going to make the header, so it shows up as a dark gray color, and then the next row will be a white background, and then a light gray, then a white background, then a light gray. It looks like this when I'm done. That means it'll help me keep track of where I'm at as I go across as I enter in new information over here. So again, select all, format, alternating colors, and you can find the pattern that works best for you. 